Hello, hello, my lovely boos. I got a video for you guys. I'm gonna be swatching these gels here. These are from Rosalind. These are their shiny platinum gel. And I have six of them. And then I, for some reason, I ordered a different one. Like, I don't know why or how, but I ordered the Rosalind shiny diamond gel, which I plan on buying more of these because. I was really shocked at how pretty this is. Wow. Anyways, I'm going to swatch this one first so you can see it. But I am definitely ordering more of these. Um, as far as the name, it has just A538 is the number that's on the bottom. I want you to look at this though. Look at that, guys. Oh, I freaking love that. So I'm using this pretty soon. This is going to be a color that I'm going to use on a uh, design I want to do. But anyways, let's go ahead and swatch this. Make sure that you're leaving the caps on your products. If you are using a ring light, you do not want to cure um, your gels. Okay. So anyways, I'm going to start from the top here and I'm just going to kind of rub that in. Now this is kind of, reminds me of the Sabuland kind of, like they're, it's a chunky gel. Um, so you can leave it scattered if you like, like this. Or you can put multiple layers and make it fully covered if you want. I like the scattered look sometimes, and so I like to see all the pieces of the gel. I love that gold in there. Oh my god, I don't know why that gold makes it look so pretty. Sorry if there's any noise in the break background. I'm going to apologize now because everybody is home. Everybody is roundabout right now. Oh gosh, that's why I hate turning them upside down. I should probably have gloves on, no doubt. But what I'm going to do, I'm just going to take this little tool right here. I'm going to pull it up like this. So we don't want to be turning them upside down because now this stuff's all over the lid. As you can see, that's beautiful. I'm going to set this to the side. I want to make sure that you mix your colors up really well before you use them.
These um, remind me of almost like a, a platinum leaf like gel, kinda, sorta, but with glitter. Well, no, that does kind of look like leaf gel. You know what I'm saying? Like the leaf platinum gel kind of. Which it is called platinum gel, so that's probably why. As you can see, that is literally one coat. Wow. That's amazing. I love it when I find a pigmented gel. It's just, that's gorgeous. It's a neon pink. Because I know my camera is not probably doing any justice at all. Let me turn it down just a little bit so you guys can see. Wow, that's pretty. Let's cure that. Alright, so let me show you what those look like. The last two I just did. And we are actually going to top coat those really fast because they do have a inhibition layer and so forth. You want to make sure that, um, I mean, you don't have to top coat it. You can use the inhibition for a lot of things. Fools and just pigment, whatever you want to do with it. But, wow, look at that once it's top coat. It really shines, does it not? I wish my camera would like show colors better. For some reason it's not showing really good colors lately. So I think I need to play around with the settings and just kind of see if I can get it to actually. I'm sure it does. I just got to figure it out. Now, now what I mean, like when you're doing these kind of gels like this, like I said, it's going to be a textured gel because it has glitter in it. So... And normally what I do when it's like that, I'll go ahead and top coat it really good. Sometimes even put two top coats over it and then I buff that top coat smooth. And then and then apply a last layer of gel is what I like to do. If I go lower, you can actually see it. But then my lighting is just kind of off. Okay, so let me go ahead and I'm going to put those back in to finish top coating. Okay, so I've got A400 here. Yeah. Oh my god. Did you just see that, guys? Oh my god. Look how pretty that is. Wow. I'm just going to put that back in here. That way it just keeps them sealed whenever I don't have them open. But that is freaking gorgeous. It's like a... Oh god, I don't even know what the what color that is. That's like a bronze, but a orange, but a copper, but a red. Oh wow. Oh wow. You know, I always kind of leer from picking colors on AliExpress because sometimes it may look a color and then when you go to get it, it looks totally different. But now let me tell you what, this right here is fabulous. You still want to keep your gels thin. Cause when curing them, you know you guys know. It don't if you don't if you make them too thick, then you're taking the chance of it uh, wrinkling or bubbling. But wow. Do this with a light hand because that leaf gel just kinda uh -oh. Look at that on my finger. My newly done nails and all. Wow, and see I say that probably the more you put on it, the darker it'll get. Alright, so let's go ahead and 
put oh, it's pretty just like that if you want it like that you can leave it like that but then if you want it just a little bit darker you want to bring up a little bit more and just add it to it and it is beautiful alright so that one is done and it is completely smooth now there's no bumps ridges or anything now and it still looks the same this one is 8396 Yeah, I'm surprised that one didn't leak out none. I'm just putting the lid back on them as I close them back up because I will tend to <coughs> spill this stuff. Okay. Anyways, guys, so that is what that one looks like. I'm just going to go ahead and top cut it real fast since it's done. And it shines so pretty with that top coat. Ooh, look at that. That's pretty. That's a pretty purple. Beautiful gold. Wow, look how bright that is. is the purple and it's got like a tint of kind of like silver in it look at this really pretty There it is. Beautiful. Ooh, look at that, guys. Mm -hmm. Look at that. 
A401, that's beautiful. And the last one that I have is A403. And there is that one. It's beautiful. But yeah, there is all of the colors. Six of the platinum gels and the, um, well, they're shiny platinum gels, what they're called. And then this one is called shiny, shiny diamond gel. So, but I will leave those linked down below for you guys so that way you can go check them out. I love them. I'm definitely ordering more. I know some really cool ideas I could probably do with these. But yeah. If you guys haven't heard, make sure to check out my latest video. Um, I will be doing a giveaway here once I reach 1500 One of you lucky winners gets a $20 from me to buy some uh, acrylic from the nail junkie and then the second person gets a thing of uh, we'll send a um, model one alcohol inks but anyways guys I love you guys hope you're having a blessed day don't forget to like comment and subscribe please share my videos if you are not subscribed hit that button let's be friends and do nail art together if you're already subscribed I just want to say Thank you so much for being so awesome. I love you all. Have a great day. Bye.